What's going on guys and welcome back to some more Mario Golf for the Nintendo 64. In the last part we did the front nine of Toad Highlands of the Toad Tournament. In this part we're going to do the back nine. Now uh, now it looks like it's going to be eight yards up but there's, tw there's 20 mile power wind going to the left so it looks like we're going to aim this a little to the right. That was a bad shot. <laughs> I'm behind a tree. You never want to be behind trees. It looks like it looks like I'm gonna have to use a higher club. I don't think I think that's still not a good enough shot. Well, I still got on the green, but that's not necessarily a putt I like. Yep, we overshot it. It can be kind of hard to calculate putts on your uh, first time playing through. You kind of have to play the game quite a bit to get used to the putty in this game. Uh, should I use a power shot? Uh, I, I want to save those for the par fives. All right, so it looks like uh, looks like this is going downhill, but I think a four wood should make make it on the green. Wow, we actually got it pretty close to the hole. Yeah, that's uh, ten feet from the hole. This is not. It's going a little left. It's going a little downhill, but it looks like it doesn't look like a hard putt. And we are in first place, and as you notice, these uh, AI start to screw up on the, uh, they start to screw up on the back nine. And this is a par five, so it looks like we're gonna use that as a power shot. Finally, I get a good power shot, and you get a special animation for it. it. It also varies from character to character. I'm not confident enough we can eagle this hole, so we're just gonna play it safe. Sometimes you can go for high risk, high reward shots if you're good enough, if you're good in this game, but I don't always recommend doing it. Uh, let's see, uh, I'm just gonna use a full approach shot. Oh my God, we almost chipped it in. So that's an easy birdie. Yeah. And it looks like we're, uh, it looks like we're, we've birdied eight holes. Thankfully, you haven't bogeyed, uh, because you should know how golf is typically scored, and if you don't, I'll punch you. But, uh, yeah, it looks like, uh, I think a two iron should do it. Uh, we undershot it. We still made it on the green edge. Not. I would prefer to be on the green, but the green edge is fine. Yeah, we undershot that putt. Nice par. <laughs> All right. So um, yeah. This the next hole is a hole 14. It looks like we're getting a lot of wind, and it's wind I like though. It's hard to play this game and commentate at the same time because you're trying to focus on perfect shot, but you're also trying to come up with entertaining commentary and release. Uh, I'm at least trying to play, teach you how to play this game well, at least. I'm gonna use a four wood, but I'm not gonna hit it all the way. That should go close to the hole. Except I overshot it a little bit. That's not a bad putt though. It doesn't look like a hard one. I say that as I miss the fucking pot. Nice part. <laughs> In hole 15, this is, it looks like we got no wind. When he has a power shot. 
That way we get closer. Well, we're gonna have enough power shots, but uh, for the next hole, I know for a fact the next hole's a par five. So yeah, I think a three iron should do it. It looks like we're we're looking at maybe a hundred fifty-seven yards. So I'll, I will just not hit it all the way. Ooh, I undershot that. This isn't really a hard chip in. I think I'll use a pitching wedge for a chip in. Well, it's good enough. But it doesn't look like we're burning this hole. Nice part. All right, Toad Highlands, this is a par five, which is a uh, hundred and uh, which is 448 yards. We're looking at, this is maybe looking like it's going like 241 yards. Did I fuck up the time and the accuracy? I guess I was way off in calculus. To be fair, we weren't, we were kind of going a little uphill. You want know, I might go all or nothing. I might use my last power shot. Try to see if I can get out on the green in two. Nice shot. We, I guess, like, if we had better distance, we could get that on the green in two. But at least we didn't. At least we got a perfect shot with the power shot. And this is an easy birdie. Hole nice 17 is the part three. It looks like it's raining, so uh, and the wind's going down. So uh, um, I'm thinking a two iron should do it. I mean, it's a forward, not hit it all the way. Because that way I think I'm confident I can go over the bunker. And I accept I was a little overconfident. Also tip. When there's a little bit of an arc like this, you kind of, when you're on a hill, you kind of want to get the whole, you kind of want to get the uh, line kind of toward the flag. Because that's about where it will land. Maybe if I hit that a little harder, it would have been a chip in. But this is an easy par. Nice par. <laughs> and we're almost done with the uh, Toad Tournament. And this is a uh, hole 18. It looks like uh, it looks like we're gonna be beaten on the wind. So I'm gonna use a I'm gonna use my last power shot. Now I have another one to use. Yay! I might make the green in two. I'm not making the green in two. <laughs> That was a, a, we, I got screwed by both the wind and the rain. I don't think that's going to go in the rough. So it's still going to, you know, we're not going to birdie this hole. So it's like, uh, I'm not even confident like a sand wedge will make it. So I'm just going to, I'm going to use a pitching wedge and not aim it all the way. That's a decent amount from the hole. I don't want to finish on a bogey, though. Nice part. And we finish on a high note. And we have officially won the Toad Tournament. So Ken came in second. And Yukiki came in tied with fourth. And uh, Bill came in uh, tenth. Bill is from Star Fox 64. And uh, she came in 16th. She tied with Link. So you're saying Zelda in disguise tied with Link. And uh, Dory from Mario 64 came in 22nd place. Fox tied with Eric in uh, third, 23rd place. Darunia. Fox tied with Darunia too. Peppy. I forgot Peppy. My boy Peppy. He came from 26. And he tied with Malon and Saria. <laughs> I just love this game's reference to other games. 
And every time we win a trophy, every course we get experience points, and uh, we won the next course. So, uh, we're gonna do something, uh, we're gonna cut off this part of Mario Golf 64. So, uh, next time on Mario Golf 64, we will uh, do the get character mode. So, I'll see you guys next time.